So, hey guys, today I am going to be making an angel, and this is what it looks like. The burlap angel. Yeah, burlap angel. So the things you'll need is an ornament, a small ornament, um, three of these pipe cleaners, a ruler. I use a dandy ruler. Um, some jewels. For just one jewel. The main part of this is the bur, the the bur, the glitter burlet. Yeah. And you'll need some ribbon. A hot glue gun. And marker and some scissors and the main part of this project is an adult to help you okay. so first thing you need to do is get your burlap and cut it 12 inch uh, Five inches of in twelve. You need twelve of these squares of five inches. So take your ruler and your ruler and and measure twelve inches. I mean five inches. And then get your marker and mark where it's five inches is right here. And then you're gonna do that to all 12. And the next step, since I already marked them, like right here, then you need to cut 12 five inches. I already did two. Because they should look about this size. And I'm gonna cut it, I'm gonna cut it every line, and then that should be enough for 12. And now that I've cut 12 of these, you'll want to like bunch them together like this. And then don't pull them tight and then like put them flat on the table and then like put it in the middle and then grab it like that so it should be like that. Now the bunch should look like this. It should look like a bunch. So now what you want to do, you want to cut a pipe, one of the pipe cleaners in half. So you have two pieces. And then you want to bunch them tightly and then Now that you've done that part, it should be like this. And then, okay, after that part, okay, that's good. And after that part, you wanna pull six down on each side since you did 12. So one, two, now you have to pull six of these down, like I said. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six. And then to make sure that there's six down, when I count to see if there's six in the row. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there's six down and six above. And you want to do that to the Now that you've burned six down on both sides, you want to take the other half and then squeeze the bottom and then wrap this around. Now your the angel for now should look like this and then you can make it all pretty after you've done that. The next step is the head. So now for the head, I've already taken the piece off. So make sure that they're plastic, not the glass ones, because it, it could be glass, but I recommend plastic. So 
make sure you have parent help for this one. Make sure your parent helps because you're using something really hard. Okay, so get your bowl and then put glue on the inside. I like glue on the outside, like right here. And then glue on the sides. So it should be like that. They, so it should look like it's full and then on the sides. Now, I'm going to put this, so this part right here, I stuck it up so that I can easily put it on top. Now the angel's head should be on your angel like this. So the next part is to make the bow. To make the bow, you'll need this ribbon, and you 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 can measure it however size you want. So I'm gonna measure it about to right here, like that. But you wanna make it like this. Like that. So you wanna make two of these and then glue it onto your fairy like that. Okay, so now, the bow part should be on the angel like this. And then now to make the other part of the bow, you'll need to use your ruler and measure at least um, about four, five inches, I believe. Five inches, and then you can just cut it. Interest. And you'll only need to use make one. So and now to make the bow, you want to lay it flat like this, so the color side down, and then fold the two ends like this onto the fairy. Not fairy. Take your put glue in the middle and then put the other color in there and then put the more glue in the middle. And then you can use the you can use your scissors if you don't want to use your fingers and get burnt. Okay, now the whole bow should look like so this. So the next step is to get a jewel. I got it from um, Dollar Tree. You can get these from the Dollar Tree. And I'm just using a heart. And then you wanna put glue on the angels. Um, bow and then glue that part to the book. Okay, so the next part is the, the halo. So you're gonna get a pipe cleaner and then you want to take the angel, turn it upside down, and then measure how big you want your halo to be. Don't tie it until you know the size of your hair is So it's gonna look like that. So it's gonna look like that. You want to glue a 
the, the pipe cleaner part to the body. So you're gonna put it on about where the head is. Well, on the head, where it's really close, and then blow it. And now to make the part, the, like this part right here, from the angel, it's the, um, the hook so you can hang it from a tree. So it's the hook for you can hang it off the tree. And then you want to glue it on top of the halo. And now your angel should look just like this. Thanks for watching how to make a burlap. a burlap angel. Burlap. Burlap angel. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my other videos. Bye.